Hey everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. So in this video, we're going to be reviewing Document 360. We're going to be looking at how enterprise organizations build scalable online help centers. If your inbox is drowning, your chat widget never stops blinking, or maybe your onboarding docs live in 10 different Google folders, then in that case, you absolutely need a solid help center that can slash support tickets, smooth employee training, and boost product adoption. Over the past few weeks, I have been testing out Document 360. I have tested every major feature so i'm going to be giving you the full review including an overview of the tool's best features pros cons security and more by the end of this video you should have all of the information necessary to know whether you should actually get yourself a subscription or not and now let's go ahead and get started with number one what problem does document 360 solve so as you may know most companies store information in silos slack threads dropbox pdfs notion pages or tickets and that causes some problems such as customers can't find answers and the new hires repeat the same questions. That's where Document360 solves that by giving you a public knowledge base for frequently asked questions, tutorials, and release notes. They also offer you a private knowledge base for policies, SOPs, and tribal knowledge, API documentation, and their powerful search, analytics, and workflows so content stays accurate at scale. So essentially, it's an all-in-one platform to help you create, share, and manage your knowledge bases, software documentation, AP docs, SOPs, and more. Now, when it comes to getting started, it's actually pretty simple. All you have to do is go and type into your browser document360.com, or you can navigate to the link below this video for convenience. You will land on this page right here where you can enter your work email. And then from here, you can book a demo where a specialist is going to be on call with you and walk you through the entire process. Now, if you would like to test this platform out for yourself, get some hands-on experience on all of these features, then you would have to click on the purple start free trial button at the top right corner. And then you can create your account using your first name, last name, and work email to start a 14 day free trial without a credit card requirement. Now, if you did launch your free trial, such as my sub account right here, as you can see, I already have 13 days in this trial. You will land on this intuitive dashboard right here. With this trial, it means that you can test out almost every feature without any limits. Now, when it comes to writing and organizing content, Document 360 uses a modern block-based editor. When you type a forward slash, the editor shows a palette of building blocks such as the headings, paragraphs, numbered lists, code sections, accordions, tab sets, and even mermaid diagrams for flowcharts. You can easily drag images or videos straight into the page and the system automatically hosts them on a content delivery network so they look crisp on the screens and load fast even on phones. If you prefer Markdown, you can flip the entire article into raw text, edit, and then flip back without losing formatting. Next up, we have reusable snippets and variables. Global snippets such as support hours are 9am till 5pm EST, update everywhere after a single edit. Variables like product name switch between staging and production, so teams avoid duplicate articles for different environments. And then we have the AI assistant as you can highlight a paragraph and then select rewrite or summarize and document 360 will generate a refined version. The AI assistant can handle all of the grammar and the clarity very reliably, although technical terms still deserve a manual check. We also have the future roadmap items, which promise full answers to just drafts created from incoming tickets. So at this point, we know that Document360 is a SaaS knowledge-based platform that enables businesses to create, organize, and maintain comprehensive documentation systems. It is primarily designed to serve two primary purposes. The public knowledge basis, which is perfect for SaaS companies, course creators, and businesses looking to provide self-service support options to their customers without requiring login credentials. And second is the private knowledge basis, which are ideal for internal training, standard operating procedures, and company wikis where access control is essential. Moving on, let's go ahead and talk about the category management. This is one of Document 360's standout features, which is all about its robust category management system. The platform allows you to create a hierarchical structure for your documentation, organize articles into folders, pages, and indexes, set up parent-child relationships between categories, and control visibility settings for different sections. This structured approach ensures that users can easily navigate through your knowledge base and quickly find the information that they need. Now, other than that, Document360 understands the importance of brand consistency. And for that, the platform offers you multiple theme options with further customization capabilities, custom domain integration, logo and favicon uploads, color scheme adjustments to match your brand, custom CSS and JavaScript options for advanced users, 
and further and header navigation customization. These features allow you to create a knowledge base that feels like a natural extension of your existing web properties. And then for the teams collaborating on documentation, let's talk about something that I already mentioned in the intro, and that is the powerful workflow management. So after having used Document360 for a few weeks now, one of my favorite things about it is how customizable the workflow stages are between the draft, first edit, review, and published. We also have the article assignment capabilities, team member notifications, and it helps you with progress tracking across different workflow states. So this workflow system ensures quality control and helps manage the documentation process across larger teams. And then to help you optimize your knowledge base even further, then you also have the user behavior tracking, search analytics to identify gaps in your content, performance metrics for individual articles, and geographic data on user access. All of these features in the analytics and the insights will enable you to continuously improve your strategy and your documentation based on actual user behavior and needs. And then when it comes to security, Document360 takes it seriously. And that is really evident through features such as the daily automated backups, role-based access control, IP restrictions, custom domain mapping with SSL, and private knowledge base options. These measures ensure that your documentation remains secure and accessible only to authorized users where needed. So, Document360 strikes an impressive balance between powerful functionality and user-friendly design. The platform's interface is clean and intuitive, with a logical arrangement of features that makes navigation straightforward. As for content creators, the editing experience is smooth and responsive. Their editor in particular makes it easy to create professional-looking documentation without the technical expertise. The ability to save the templates also speeds up the creation process for teams that produce similar types of content regularly. And then for end users, the search functionality is robust and accurate, helping you quickly find relevant information. The mobile responsiveness ensures that documentation is accessible across devices, which is crucial for both customer-facing and internal knowledge bases. Another particularly user-friendly aspect is the onboarding process. When you first sign up, Document360 provides sample data that helps you understand how the platform works. You also get access to the demo call which helps you navigate the entire platform. And all of this on top of their 14-day free trial allows you to experiment with features before building your own knowledge base from scratch. So when it comes to the pricing structure, Document360 currently offers three tailored subscription tiers to meet the needs of different organization sizes and complexity requirements. So we have the professional plan at the moment, the business plan, and the enterprise plan. So the professional plan is ideal for growing teams that need robust documentation tools. Some of their key features include public and private knowledge base capabilities, the AI writer suite, custom domain integration, onboarding assistance, AP documentation, and homepage builder. If you would like to take a look at every one of these plans in more detail and check out each and every single one of their features, then you would have to navigate to document360.com slash pricing. You will land on this page where you can scroll down and then take a much deeper dive at each one of these features. Up next, we have the business plan, which is a comprehensive solution designed for the mid-sized businesses. This will include everything in the professional plan, plus knowledge-based widget, ticket deflector functionality, AI search suite, advanced analytics capabilities, public API access, and all platform integrations. And finally, the enterprise plan that is tailored for large organizations. This will include everything in the previous plans, plus the multiple SSO or JWT authentication options, the sandbox environment, complete AI suite, 24-5 priority support, and the onboarding, plus dedicated CSM, and training and best practices. So interestingly, Document360 follows the contact us for pricing approach that's common among enterprise SaaS providers. No specific pricing figures are publicly displayed on their website, requiring potential customers to reach out directly through the Let's Talk buttons for each tier. So this pricing strategy typically indicates custom pricing based on specific business needs and scale, potential for negotiation and tailored packages, and the emphasis on relationship building with customers rather than transactional sales. Once again, the platform still offers a 14-day free trial without requiring a credit card, and that allows you to evaluate its capabilities by yourself before engaging in pricing discussions. This approach demonstrates Document360's focus on serving businesses that value robust features and customer support over the lowest cost options. So for the pros, we have versatility as it serves both public and private knowledge-based needs effectively, user-friendly interface, 
robust search functionality, customization options, the workflow management that streamlines the content creation process for larger teams, analytics as it provides the valuable insights to continuously improve your documentation, and the 14-day free trial without any credit cards. Now, when it comes to the cons, we have the learning curve for advanced features. While basic functionality is straightforward, some of the more advanced features will require some time to master. And then we have the price point as higher tiers can be relatively expensive for smaller businesses, but that can be countered by the fact that you would have to contact them and then get a custom quote. So potentially you could be saving a lot of money based on which features you do not need included in your plan. So in conclusion, Document360 delivers on its promise of being a powerful, user-friendly knowledge-based platform suitable for businesses of all sizes. Its standout features include flexible content creation tools, robust category management, comprehensive analytics, and strong customization options. If you own a company that's serious about creating scalable documentation systems, whether for customer support or internal use, Document360 provides an excellent balance of functionality and ease of use. Also, the platform's tiered pricing structure means there is an option for most budgets. Although if you are a smaller business that you require very advanced features for some reason, then you might find the higher tiers cost prohibitive. I really recommend that you go ahead and grab the link in the description, sign up for your own free trial, test the platform out for 14 days, and then once you get a better feel for the capabilities and features, you can choose to continue with one of their plans and contact their support for more information. Thanks so much for watching this video. Let us know what you think of it by leaving a comment down below. If you have found it to be helpful and informative to watch, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.